What's going on, good people? It's Ngubu from my Runner Gun Firearms Training, and tonight I want to talk about why I no longer teach people to slow down and get their hits. All right, so first let me say that I'm not talking about issues with trigger finger discipline or muzzle awareness or anything that could cause a safety issue. That's completely different than what I'm talking about. I'm talking about fundamentals or techniques that will affect your marksmanship or ability to put rounds on target or whatever it is. Not talking about safety issues. That's a completely different thing. So if you've ever had training or even been to the range and maybe you're not hitting or placing rounds where you want, someone probably will say, slow down and get your hits, right? Um, and I don't agree with that at all. Um, this is why. Speed is not why, let's say, for example, someone is missing, right? They're not placing the rounds where they want. Maybe they're hitting low, left, or whatever. Speed is not why you're hitting low, left, or high. The issue is a fundamental that you're messing up consistently that's causing the result that you're getting. So instead of saying correct the speed when the speed isn't the issue, let's get to the root cause and figure out why you're missing, why those rounds are going left, high, low, and then fix that. So if, for example, you have issues with joint manipulation, then let's solidify our technique with joint manipulation. That way, when you go fast, it doesn't affect you. Um, if you're having issues with your maybe support side pressure with your grip or anything else, right? Let's fix that since that's the actual reason why you missed and not because you went fast. Um, so going slow, going slow, going slow in hopes that one day you're miraculously going to be fast because you've gone slow doesn't make sense at all. Um, you go to any sport, football, basketball, track and field, whatever. Um, you practice at speed. Yes, there's some days where you're working on fundamentals. You might be trying to correct some technique things but you're going to be practicing at speed. Why? Because there's going to come a time that you're going to need to be able to do that at speed. So if you're talking about practical shooting for either self-defense or even for competition, you have to be able to shoot at speed. Shooting one round per second is too slow. Shooting two rounds per second is too slow. Three rounds per second is borderline depending on how far the, the target is. Um, but if it's like most self-defense situations where it's up close and personal, then you're going to want four or five, potentially even six rounds per second. But if you've never shot that fast, or you're always going slow in hopes that one day you're going to speed up, you're going to be way out of your element if you ever have to shoot in that manner. Um, so nope, I don't believe in that slow down to get your hits bullshit. Correct the fundamental that's causing you to miss, and you won't need to slow down. Either way, if you have any questions, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Go ahead and share this if it helped you out at all. And hit me in the comments if you have anything you want to talk about. Y'all be safe.